Hello and welcome to the Excel Cave. Today we're going to talk about um, combining strings of text, currency, and dates from different cells uh, on your spreadsheet into one single cell um, that produces an output uh, or one single message. Combining all three um, where all three of those elements have their correct or proper formatting. Um, so in this example here, we have a few cells containing text, um, and the goal is we want to produce a receipt message. Um, so we have this first cell here that says, thank you, comma, attached to your receipt for the purchase and the amount of, and we'd like to pull in the purchase amount from this cell, um, and then next pull in this next line of text made on and then our purchase date and finally the period from this cell and just combine all five of those cells into one single message um, with the end goal being we simply just want to generate multiple receipts where all we have to do is change the purchase amount in this cell and generate the same message over and over again with a different purchase amount and <clears throat> you know the today function being in this date cell so that this function always pulls in the current date um, so to do that we would use the and symbol to concatenate or join these cells together um, the problem is when you combine text, currency, and dates into one single cell, Excel will generally um, reflect the currency and the dates in their generic uh, text or general formats, meaning you know it'll just reflect uh, 3500 without the decimal places or the thousand separator or the dollar symbol, and the purchase date will uh, be reflected in the generic uh, serial number format. Um, so I'll go ahead and join them and show you what it looks like before we insert the text function um, on those numerical values. <coughs> um, so you can see what the formatting looks like before we do that. So we've got our first text here. We want to use the and symbol to join the purchase amount. Then we have this next line of text and then we want to pull in the date purchase date and then finally we want to pull in the period on the end so you can see we have our message thank you attached to your receipt for the purchase and the amount of $3,500 it's just in the general format uh, no dollar symbol no comma for the thousandths place no decimal places and the date is in the generic serial number format um, not the month, day, year that we would desire. So what you need to do is in these two fields here, the, the purchase amount and the purchase date, we need to insert the text function to um, format those values. So the text function is not real complex it's just got two arguments your cell reference or your value and then the format you want that value or cell reference to be in so in this cell here e3 we want <coughs> this to be in currency so oh sorry i about forgot this second argument must be enclosed in double quotes so don't forget that um, so we want the currency format, so it begins with a dollar symbol followed by a number and then a comma for the thousandths place, two more number symbols followed by a zero and then uh, period zero zero for the decimal places and then don't forget the double quote and closing parentheses and then now for our purchase date we want to do the same thing but in the second argument specify a date format so we're going to insert the text function again our first argument is our cell reference second argument is the date format enclosed in double quotes so it's just month month slash day day slash 
year, 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 year. Close your parentheses, hit enter, and now you can see we have this nice message that says thank you attached as your receipt for the purchase in the amount of $3,500 now formatted in currency format with our dollar symbol, our thousand separator decimal places, and our date uh, in the month, day, year format that we like to have. And now we have this nice receipt output that all we have to do now is simply change the dollar amount to generate a different or new receipt. So that is how you can quickly combine uh, strings of text, currency, and dates into one single output with the correct formatting using the text function in Excel. Thanks for watching, guys.